remember my first visit to the Krusty Krab? I don't know. This doesn't look like a family restaurant. No. Oh. Well, what do you think, baby? Would you like to eat here? <laughs> well, okay then. What would you like? What the? Oh, gross! I command you to stop drooling on me! Put me down! Ow! Stop it! I'm an adult! Huh? I don't believe it! The Krabby Patty formula! Teething on it! Give it here, you big stupid baby! Ow! I've got it! Just like taking candy from a baby! Get it, Krabs? Like taking candy from you! Hey! What are you doing? SpongeBob's first patty didn't go so well either. A perfect patty on the first try. Oh, I'll make a funny patty out of you. Who the barnacles is SpongeBob SquarePants? I believe you went to kindergarten with him, dear. Kindergarten, huh? Oh, yeah, square pants. Well, I guess it's time to move again. <laughs> Come on, little man. Let's go a couple of rounds. If you think you're tough. Why should we? Because it'll show what a little man you are. Secret garden is finally done. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that one. It's beautiful. I'll take it. Hi, neighbor. I'm SpongeBob SquarePants. And we're going to be bestest friends. Hey, Patrick, guess who just moved in right next door? Neighborhood! <laughs> Gary, this won't be easy, but the time has come when I must say... Oh, Gary, it's a framed photo of the moment I picked you out at the pound. I remember that day like it was yesterday. Oh, and a photo of the time you built me a castle made of glitter and lollipops. Oh, Gary, this is the most special... Oh. Nice try, Gary. Hurry, Mr. Krabs, before it's too late. I gotta tell you about it. Permission to come aboard, Captain! I've been training my whole life for the day I could join the Krusty crew. And now I'm ready. So, uh, 
When do I start? Well, lad, it looks like you don't even have your sea legs. Mr. Krabs, please, I'll prove I'm fry cook material. Ask Squidward, he'll vouch for me. No. Well, lad, we'll give you a test. And if you pass, you'll be on the crusty crew. Go out and fetch me a uh, uh, hydrodynamics spatula with, um... Port and starboard attachments and uh, turbo drive. And don't come back till you get one. Hi, hi, Captain. One hydrodynamic spatula with port and starboard attachments, turbo drive. Coming right up, sir. Carry on. We'll never see that lubber again. You're terrible. A hydro what? <laughs> <laughs> Fast foodsmanship I've ever seen, Mr. Squarepants. Welcome aboard. But, but, Mr. Crab. Hey, cheers for SpongeBob. Hip, hip. All right, hip, yeah, Mr. Crab. Hip, hip. All right. Hip, hip. All right, Mr. Crab. I'll be in my quarters. Count it out the booty. You don't need a professional to teach you how to drive. You know, Mr. Krabs, at boating school, Mr. Wipe that boating school malarkey out of your mind, son. It's all a racket. It is? And that goes for every kind of schooling. Why, there ain't nothing truly important. You can't learn on the streets with half a jigger of common sense and your own two claws. Now put her in gear! Okay! <laughs> well, rookie mistake, boy. Happens all the time. It does? No, but you got the right fire in your belly. I do? Yes. Uh, well, you know what we need is a change of venue. This empty parking lot is just the ticket. Like every young person, the novice bowler needs plenty of open, obstacle-free space and the freedom to make mistakes. Mr. Krabs, you're so wise. <laughs> Can't disagree with you there. All right, put her in gear! Hmm. Rookie mistake, right? I suppose so. Now slowly, inch forward, and we'll check out the damage. Inch, 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 inch. about 15,000. Oh, kitchen fire. Oh, that'll be about six grand. Oh, lawsuit. Oh, that's a lot of zeros. Oh. All right, Krabs, get a hold of yourself. You've been in worse fixes than this. Well, you stared down at Cunning's mouth, haven't you? Look at that face. Ugh. Ugh. Is this the face of your final defeat? Is it, Krabs? Now here's a place you should be comfortable with. Oh, I'll say. Just take a look around, boyo. Oh, 
home, sweet home. Nothing to make you twitchy and jumpy. Well, just the opposite, in fact. A place so soothing and sweet. Like a mother's gentle lullaby on a soft summer's Aww. night. Start with something simple. A little trip down the street to Patrick's house. I'll have one Krabby Patty, please. Okay. Excellent. <sighs> Would you like fries with that? Yeah, sounds good. Better. Okay, that was just fine. But next time, wait until I say, put her into gear. <laughs> You missed one. Uh, a simple trip to Patrick's house. A line so straight and true. Mr. Krabs, let's just leave the boat here and walk. Well, we, you know, we could do that. But you can't learn to drive without a boat. Or can ye? You'll certainly learn the way of the road with this here top-of-the-line, state-of-the-art technological simulator. <laughs> now hand me one of them tokens. You need your protective headgear. Ready, drive. I'm doing it, Mr. Krabs. I'm driving the boat. Driving. Great job, boy! Crab that time. <laughs> oh, hello, SpongeBob. What a nice surprise. Come here and give your granny her kissy kissy. Sorry, Grandmother, but the kissing has to stop. Tell her like it is, SpongeBob. No more baby stuff. He is right, Grandmother. Kisses are for babies, which I am no longer. I have grown up. It is nature's way. Oh, you are absolutely right. I am. I mean, of course I am. You will definitely not be treated like a baby around here ever again. I am glad you see it my way, Grandmother. Well, I'm glad that's settled. But what am I going to do with all these fresh-baked cookies? <laughs> Sorry, Grandmother. We adults don't partake in the consumption of sweets. Right, Pat? Trick? Keep them coming, Granny! <laughs> so much for no more baby stuff. <laughs> and don't forget the cookie-eating hat! <laughs> hey! That's my cookie-eating hat! Uh, I mean, it was when I was a baby. <laughs> well, look who's here! It's my big old adult grandson. Grandmother? I need to have a mature conversation with Mr. Patrick. Patrick, what are you doing? Cookies, warm milk, a bib. Is that a kissy mark on your forehead? We are supposed to be adults. Uh oh, oh, no roughhousing with a full tummy. <laughs> the baby. I'm the baby. I'm the baby. I'm the baby. <laughs> Grown-up is boring. I love being a baby. Besides, I don't get jazz. Oh, poor Patrick. I almost feel sorry for you. Trapped in the awkward phase of diaper days, never to know the rich rewards of being a grown-up. Here's a fresh batch of cookies. All right. Reward. 
birds. Oh, yeah, there's... Oh, let's see, we, uh, we went over the jazz. Tell Grandma I'm full. More cookies. It appears to be my lunch hour. Ooh, grown ups have to eat too. I guess this will have to do. Oh, you don't want this baby food. How about a big piece of steamed coral? Oh, yeah. Uh, great. Nutritious. Story time. Oh, boy. Story time, story time, story time. Story time? You'll enjoy this, Patrick. It's a wonderful story about a magical sea leprechaun. Oh, SpongeBob, you wouldn't be interested in this baby book. Here's the technical manual on routine active maintenance. Oh, uh, great. Yeah, fascinating. No pictures, just the way I like it. <laughs> oh, my little finger! Hold still, hold still. Mm. All better? Sorta. Of. This finger hurts a little bit too. Mm. How about I give you a present? Oh boy, I hope it's cookies. Oh, right! Another hat! No, Patrick, it's a sweater. Huh? With love in every stitch. No. Don't I get a present, Grandma? Oh, I almost forgot. Here's some office supplies. I didn't wrap them. I knew you wouldn't mind. Uh-oh, three o'clock. Time for adults to go to work. Bye-bye, SpongeBob. I'll bet you'd fancy a nap, huh, Patrick? You're still here, SpongeBob? Uh, I don't have to leave yet. I can be late for work. No, no, no. That wouldn't be the adult thing to do. All right, uh, I guess I'll be going. I've, uh, got a lot of adult-type business to take care of. So, uh, I'll see you later. Okay, thanks for stopping by, SpongeBob. <laughs> Only oh, SpongeBob. <laughs> there is something different about you today. You seem more able-bodied. Oh, must be the long pants. <laughs> so they are. You run the register today. Hi, how are you? Looking good. Mustard with that? All right. How is that patty treating you, sir? Are you an angel? No, merely a man. A man in long pants. Oh, my precious long pants! What's wrong, Slick? You're not having trouble with your pants, are you? Nothing like that, Mr. Krabs. I just don't think I'm made or dematerial. Yeah, you're right. You're too good for this place. Much as I hate to admit it, I've outgrown the Krusty Krab. Time for me to move on. Where's he going? A place called Manhood. Today's special is a most amusing Indian Ocean seagrass, hand-picked by indigenous prawns, pre-chewed by local manatees, and then smothered in a rich red algae. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Nice. Extraordinary. And may I add those are very impressive britches you're wearing? Britches? Oh, these old things. What is your name? SpongeBob. Uh, Sponge Robert. Well, Sponge Robert, how would you like to join us? We're going to a party. Boy, what I? I love parties. <laughs> 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 
What are you looking for, Sponge Robert? I'm looking for the party. This is the party. Well, where's the party hats? Where's the cake? And the clown? You can't have a party without a clown. Oh, Sponge Robert, <laughs> if it weren't for your pants, I'd take you for the type of immature ignoramus that would frequent the crusty crab. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what's that? The Mermaid Man and Barnica Boy movie is opening tonight! Wow, I totally forgot! Hey, guys, I've got an idea. Let's all go to the Mermaid Man movie. <laughs> You're incorrigible, but Le Cinema is a delightful idea. There's a foreign film at the art house I've been meaning to see. It's called The Table. I don't get it. We've been staring at this table for three hours. That table could use a cleaning. Some people are trying to enjoy Le Cinema. Oh, hey, Squidward. Hey, do you understand what this movie is about? Nobody does. It's art. Now sit down. Hey, Squidward. What? Are you remembering to flip the patties clockwise? It's very important because the heat... Please sit down! I'm sorry, sir. You're being too loud. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Oh, wait! Squidward! I walked out! Squidward! Hey, SpongeBob! Y'all going to see the Mermaid Man movie with us? SpongeBob! You who? Are you coming? We're going to drink some more coffee and watch the nightly news. Wow! That sounds pretty grown up, Sponge Robert. My pants say yes, 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 but my heart says no. I want to see the Mermaid Man movie. <laughs> now you really sound like one of those nitwits that frequents the Krusty Krab. Not only am I one of those nitwits, I actually work there. A peasant in long pants! Social climbing sponge! Pelzer! Let's leave this bottom feeder! Atta boy! Patrick, breakfast is ready! All right! All this parenting stuff makes me hungry! Hey, Junior, how you doing today? SpongeBob? Yes, Patrick! Kids got a stinky. Did you take care of them? My hands are kind of full. <laughs> ah! Wish I could, but I gotta get going. Going? Where are you going? Going to work. I'm the dad, remember? You mean I have to do all this baby stuff myself? I'll give you a break tonight when I get home. Don't you two stop being adorable. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What a day. Oh, great, you're home. Now you can help me with the baby. Oh, gee, SpongeBob, I'd love to. But I'm totally beat from work. Huh? <gasps> oh. <laughs> that guy got hit in the head with a coconut. Patrick, <laughs> what about my break? Oh, yeah, your break. Uh, tomorrow, I promise. Uh, okay, tomorrow. We need to talk. Just one more minute. I Go gotta... one more minute me, Mr. Man. Hey, I'm missing the coconut. You haven't been helping at all with Junior. We made a commitment and you're not doing your share. You never do anything. I changed his diaper. Yeah, once. He's only this big. How many diapers can he possibly use? Mm. Oh, that's not so much. Mm. So? Mm. <laughs> What kind of father am I? I'll make it up to you, buddy. I promise. <laughs> oh, boy, that was some party. Oh, hey, SpongeBob. Hey, Junior. What? What? Oh, nothing. Oh, what a relief. For a second, I thought you were mad at me. Do you remember what you said to me this morning? Something about root beer, right? No. Oh, wait, wait, let me guess.
Yes. I give up. Does you can take the night off, pal? Ring a bell. I don't need this. What? Where do you think you're going? I'm going back to work. Work? <laughs> he got in there with two coconuts. So, this is work? You know, it's not as easy as it looks. Sometimes I gotta move the antenna, sometimes I lose the remote, and sometimes my butt itches real bad. Oh, you poor, poor thing. By the way, you forgot your briefcase. <laughs> oh, so this is the thanks I get for working overtime. Oh, yeah, you're working. If you're that's the kind of work you're doing, you're show me where you're too tired to work. Because I ain't working my fingers to the bone. You never have, working. never. There's that stupid noise again. Oh, that's not a stupid noise. That's just Junior about to jump out of that two-story window. Oh. Junior! Did you catch him? No. We're bad pirates! <laughs> oh, <laughs> Junior? He's flying. I guess he's all grown up. Hey, what about Daddy? <laughs> That's my boy. Goodbye. Goodbye, Junior. Well, Patrick, he doesn't need us anymore. This is the hardest part of every parent's life, I assume. Despite all we've been through, it was worth it. Yeah. Let's have another. Marco. Polo. Bonja. <laughs> Now it's your turn to call Marco. Do I know you, young man? Patrick, it's me. Remember? Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? I don't know. A, a wizard? A diamond and yellow and porous is he? What? It's just a bunch of squarepants. Ah, the one and only. Okay, now it's your turn to call Marco Polo. Oh, I can't do that. I, I'm all wrinkled now. I, I do old stuff. Old stuff? Like what? Check it out. This is called doddering. <laughs> oh. oh, hey, here's another thing I do now. It's called gumming. Gum. It's called complaining. These kids today, they don't know diddly squat. Wow, Patrick, that those are all great things, but wouldn't you rather go jellyfishing? Oh, no, that hurts. We could build sandcastles. It's not structurally sound. Well, how about blowing bubbles? Nothing bad about a bubble. Ooh. Are you trying to kill me, son? No, I just think we should act our age. Remember when we used to look forward to rainy days and building cushion forts? These days I only look forward to my final exit. Oh, he was too young. No. No, no, he wasn't. We are not, not young. young. Come on, people. Just because you're old doesn't mean you're rotting fish. You're still vital, full of life. Fresh. Fresh? You see? Oh, jazz! <laughs> so sorry. <laughs>
from stealing a Krabby Patty. What was that, Sonny? It'll take more time to explain than you have left. What? <laughs> Get the Krabby Patty! Get him! Get you! Oh, did not I? <laughs> Victory is mine! <laughs> <laughs> You little whippersnapper. You kids get off my lawn. Oh, boy. I'll catch up with you, boy. I'm catching up with my knitting. That's it. That's your little knitwit. That was almost too easy. What? 